Is Worlds fearless? No. I don't think Worlds should ever be fearless. I don't think, um... I don't think Worlds should ever be fearless. L take? Nah, I think... I think fearless is really fun, but I don't think I would want Worlds to be fearless. I, I, as a league viewer, I really enjoy watching, like, um... I really enjoy watching drafts have, like, uh, picks of the series and, like, how people, like, find ways to counter their best champs. Uh, so, yeah. I'm not a fan of it. Like, that DRX T1 series was mega special just because of the way the drafts worked, I think. Like, you have to ban this, you have to ban that, you have to ban Heimer, you have to ban Caitlyn. Oh my god, they left it open. They've got an answer for it. How are they going to answer it? They are so confident to leave open this guy's best champ. They must have a response. Like, that stuff is so cool, I think. That's why I, I went for a fearless. It's really, like, hits the peak, peak, peak of your, like... Your skill level, I think. Whereas Fearless just shows your like overall skill, which I'm saying is, is also good, but for a world title, I think... Yeah, I think dissecting the pick of the series and finding ways to counter enemy strategies is better than having more strategies, if that makes sense. Because then you go quant quantity over quality, I think, a little bit. But yeah. I think a lot of people are on the, hi on the hype of Fearless Wrath because they're like, oh my god, look at how many champs there are. But yeah. Fearless is super hyped, don't get me wrong.